Look okay, everyone, I'm gonna give you a tour of our Airbnb. We've arrived to Nigeria, Lagos, and uh, we came last, uh, yesterday, last night. So I'm gonna give you a quick, quick tour of where we live. It's so clean, beautiful, AC, everything. So yeah, okay, follow along. So the place is a secure estate and this is our little bungalow here. Here's the entryway. You come in, you see this beautiful plant. It's petite and quaint, just what we need. So when you come in, we have the living area here on your left. More like right, we have this guest. The guest toilet. And so we have the living area, the TV right there. We have another booth, it's like a dining table with, the, with some booth. This is how we keep all of our Earth first other access things. Bella is having breakfast this morning. <laughs> the internet has been great so far. I love the boots. They're very comfy and both of us can easily sit there and work when we don't have anything uh, like calls, just things like that. There's a the kitchen. There's like a one uh, two in one washer and dryer, the microwave. I love the cabinets, the finish of it. It's just clean. Things that are not keeping anything like germs. So it's easy to, cl easy to clean. So I can trust that um, not a lot of germs stayed in the in the room. That's the kitchen. I'm not gonna do a lot of cooking, but love the sink. It's really deep. But when we came. The Airbnb already had a few goodies for us. I brought this for Abby, applesauce, um, but we had the Indomie, the coffee, and all the breakfast stuff. Um, and then the plantains, <laughs> it's very cool. I really appreciate that was really, really thoughtful for them to have that. Um, some plates. Just what you need, you know? And I like it about that. There's like this window at by the kitchen just to let the vent and air flow. The fridge is pretty good size. Not too big, not small either. Just fits perfectly. This is like kind of like a little storage. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's a storage. But I like how they actually were thoughtful. You know, in the U.S., it's built in. When you come in, you have this built in in some apartments, most apartments. So I like how they thought about putting something like this, you know, um, to flow. It's like a little storage to put your stuff. So this is just really great to have that feature. Uh, this place was looking kind of big. It was bigger, you know, from the eating area to the kitchen we thought there was kind of like more space from there to here but uh it looks more smaller in the quaint in real person but it's fine i don't mind it let's go to the to the bedrooms now this is uh one of the bedrooms this is where abby uh sleeps we just push the, the bed against the wall and at night this is actually another bed it's actually, actually another bed underneath so when you pull it the bed come out um so what i do is i pull out the bed and she sleeps there and in case she falls she's gonna fall on that bed and then i put this little side table to block uh, the bed so that those are the windows look at the windows you guys so you can actually close it to have this top layer cover here at night it's not blind like it's not very cold clothes and no light through no see-through but it's 
it's good enough not for kids but good enough for an adult here is her little restroom and i love this mom's kids feature it's just happy mom the happy mom in me was like I was really, really able to brush Abila's teeth here today, and she could reach the water. She could. She actually. This is actually her height. So, um, I feel like this is pretty cool. I didn't even see that in the pictures, but this is amazing that they have that feature. This is her uh, uh, the shower. Shower water go comes down pretty good. I haven't had any issue we took a shower last night before going to bed so it's great i love 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 that sink for abby then i right, just show you the bed another big window the window we are on the lower level so the window leads to the walking space and stuff so i'm not gonna go ahead and open all of them just to have more light so i'm just gonna leave it just at that i brought a camera with me for everywhere we're going to be at i'm going to be able to monitor uh, the rooms where abila is going to be and so yeah brought a camera um <clears throat> we've also brought the car car seat with us this is a little armoire um actually it's not little it's big it has lots of space so I was just able to put one suitcase that Abila had. So very accessible. Let's go to our room. This is where I and I sleep. Same thing with the windows. And I like that little feature. Do you see that over there? I like the feature where you can put my phone because it's so thoughtful they thought you know the, the room was small so they couldn't put this is a, a king size bed which i love we have a queen in our house but i love this one see abby's little bunny over there because she she fell asleep here with us before going to her room i was you know i just wanted to ease her into the the new environment but i was saying that they have a side table here but because they couldn't fit another side table they, were, they thought of putting that a little a shelf there so that was really thoughtful ac blowing nicely and love it um and this other big armoire here for the the two of us it's amazing um yeah so those are our backpacks that's my backpack um I feel actually pretty good having just one backpack because then I have my clothing out there and that's what I wear. When they get dirty, just do laundry real quick. Um, it's been pretty good. I am falling in love with having less, that's for sure. I know I'm gonna have a whole series of my, about my journey to minimalism, but I, I, it's hard, very difficult for me emotionally and even mentally and everything, but um, I really enjoy the fact that I'm having less. We brought these, uh, we thought about bringing these uh, little, very light weight laundry basket. So we brought it from home. So we're gonna put the basket. I brought some of our other toys. I don't wanna open it now because we are just here for seven days in this uh, Airbnb. So here, is the bathroom it's pretty large probably not for my husband who is tall and all that stuff but yeah it's it's very nice i like that they have this where i can do my makeup while i'm bio it's taking a shower and using that other um mirror over there then i can do my makeup here it's very thoughtful again I could put all my tampons here and some of the little things that need accessible when I, I take a shower. Here's the stuff. Mm. Look at the sink. The sink is huge. It's beautiful. All white and clean, just like I love them. So yeah, this is the, the shower. Rain shower, same thing, everything. Um, and that dip 
little window shelf where you can put your the soaps so yeah guys i hope you are you've enjoyed the ride so far i cannot wait to show you more that i'm now that i'm here in nigeria it's i'm very excited to be here to see the country and uh you know travel around lagos and nigeria hopefully we'll go to some more places if i feel comfortable traveling around but yes um bye guys